several months ago when news broke about Brett Favre and the state of Mississippi and potentially misappropriated welfare funds, the story went viral. Everyone put their two cents in, including some of the biggest people in sports media, Pat McAfee included. Brett Favre did not like some of the things that were said about him, and he announced that he was suing Pat McAfee along with others for defamation. Well, now it looks like that legal battle that so many people were anticipating going forward is over. Pat McAfee announced today on the Pat McAfee Show that Brett Favre has withdrawn the lawsuit, the defamation lawsuit that he filed against Pat McAfee. Brett Favre has a little bit different wording for it other than withdrawn. He says settled, but either way, it's not going forward any longer. Pat McAfee reveals Brett Favre has dropped the defamation suit against him. I'm glad we have all this behind us. And we are going to go to Pat McAfee's statement. It's not very long. He did it to start out the Pat McAfee show this morning. He still obviously had his house, newborn baby, all of that stuff. But Brett Favre had a little bit different wording. Brett Favre says he and Pat McAfee have settled Favre's defamation case and even tweeted out about this. Still not allowing any replies, a little bit bitch made Brett, but there you go. I'm happy that Pat McAfee and I have settled this litigation. Like Pat said, he was attempting to be funny and not commenting based on any personal knowledge. We'd both rather talk about football. Let's hear how Pat McAfee makes this announcement. Hello, beautiful people. I'm coming to you live from my humble abode. Welcome to my casa. As many of you know, Brett Favre sued me over statements that I made about him on this program. As I confirmed in my court papers, and I repeat here, my statements expressed in comedic style were based solely on public information and allegations. As I have previously stated, I respect the hell out of Brett Favre, the football player, and his Hall of Fame career on the field, and I have no personal knowledge about any case involving Brett in Mississippi. I am pleased to report that based solely on me again clarifying these points now, with no settlement paid, Brett is withdrawing his suit against me. I would much rather talk about sports than about lawsuits, so I'm glad we have all of this behind us. We now move on. And then you got, you got the rest of Pat McAfee crew screaming about sports. Now, obviously, there's a pre-prepared statement. This is what the settlement was, is my guess. Brett Favre wanted him to read this very specifically out. Uh, it was not will Pat McAfee was not willing to pay anything or admit that he was wrong. He basically says, yes, I was talking about what was in these reports. I was not alleging anything from my personal knowledge or information on it. And I'm going to read this. And as long as I clarify that, once again, you will drop the settlement. And that's what has happened no money paid out, no nothing like that, but Brett Favre, Pat McAfee, this is over. Of course, Brett Favre's legal problems might not be over. We'll see how those things go. That is a different story completely, but in terms of this big money showdown between Brett Favre, Pat McAfee, big defamation lawsuit, that is officially over. Are we going to have a similar thing happen with someone like Shannon Sharp, who Pat or who Brett Favre also named as a separate defamation lawsuit? I guess we'll see going forward. Let me know what you think about all this in the comments section below. Smash the like button, subscribe to the channel, ring the bell for notifications, share this video out there, and I'll talk to you later.